All right, ear infections in dogs. If your dog's ears hang over, okay, like a lab, hang over, okay, that confirmation is ripe for chronic ear infections. And the reason why is because sunlight, no light gets in there, and number one, moisture's trapped. And that's the prime conditions for a yeast infection, okay? Yeast infections typically look, they have a dark, uh, kind of black looking wax and they cause your dog to shake his head like that. So um, it's pretty common in labs, coon hounds, different animals like that. So yeast is a fungus that's different. Actually it's, it's a uh, fungus which is differentiated from a bacteria. You treat a fungus with antifungals you treat bacteria with antibiotics. Lots of times they'll have both, but predominantly they get a yeast infection in the ears, okay? And so um, any kind of antifungal, clotrimazole, myconazole, fluconazole, any of the azoles are good at treating fungal infections of the ears. The other thing you can do is treat, or excuse me, change the pH of the ear. A lot of these over the counter, uh, ear medicines change the pH in the ear and that helps to kill the yeast uh, by changing the pH okay so the big take-home message is that if your dog has ears that hang over that confirmation is perfect for stuff to grow in the ears and in the south in a hot humid environment dogs consistently and chronically get yeast infections and bacterial infections what you can do uh, is you can go either to the veterinarian's office or you can go to Petco, PetSmart, uh, any probably farm store and you can buy ear cleaner for dogs. Okay, and what you got to do is you got to turn your dog's head, fill that ear up real good and rub it around vigorously. Fill it up till the stuff's overflowing and then let them go and they'll run off shaking their head. They may slide on the ground and itch it on the ground. That's okay. It's good. But when they shake their head like that, then it throws a lot of that debris out. And if you've got a dog that has the confirmation, like I've said three times, where the ears hang over and you look in there and it's black and it's gooey, you need to do that twice a week, especially during the spring and the summer. Okay, that'll keep your ear infections at bay.